All right, people, welcome back. More Fake Card Friday. So this Fake Card was actually sent to me, and I heard that it's kind of like another you know, Ubell supporting card. So we're going to go ahead and see if this card is real, how much would it really help. So this is Labui or Labai? I'm not sure. It's not, it's one of them. The Dabalic Archer. I'm just going to call him Dabalic Archfiend for the rest of this video. It is a level 8 Dark Fiend Synchro Effect Monster. 2000 attack, 2000 defense. The stats are kind of low for, you know, a Sync 8. Like, really low. Well. Like, can he at least be 2500? Like, 2000 attack and defensive. That's the stats of a, of a Sync 6, not a Sync 8. So, hopefully, he has a great effect to make up for that pitiful, pitiful stat. So, made with one Dark Tuner Monster plus one or more Dark Non Tuner Monsters. So, Dark on Dark. Like, Harder to make than Beals, because even the non tuner has to be dark. dark. Beals is just, hey, is it is it tuner dark? All right, then you can make me. But this is both, which, of course, uh, since it's supposed to be Ebel related, I can easily make that in Supervised decks. It's just Doom Shaman plus Tinker. Make it, so that's fine. So let's go ahead and look at the effect. Cannot be tributed. Okay, well, you don't do too much tributing outside of just, you know, first form Ubel. So... Okay, I'm assuming that maybe has to do something with first form Ubel. <laughs> is this card can't be tributed? You don't do a lot of tributing in the deck except for first form Ubel. It's like, hey, tribute a monster destroy itself, but this card can't be tributed. So if this is on the field with first form Ubel, you can't tribute this card. Uh, next effect: When this card is synchro summoned, you can special summon one fiend type monster with zero attack and defense from your hand or graveyard. Increase that card's attack and defense equal to its level slash rank times three hundred, even if this card leads to field. Okay, so. Uh, outside of Ubel, I don't know too many fiend type monsters with zero attack and defense. Like, maybe like Battlefighter? Does, does Battlefighter have zero attack? But he gets banished when he removes from the field, so I don't know. Let's just go with first form Ubel. The other ones, it doesn't say ignoring summoning conditions, so first form Ubel. Summon it, and it's a 3000 beater, pretty much. <laughs> uh, that's not terrible. And even if this card leaves the field, you'll go ahead and keep that attack. The problem is, is that. You summon this, this will summon Ubel, it'll be a 3,000 meter, but then during the end phase, what, Ubel can't tribute this, so it's not like you're going to keep your Ubel as a 3,000 meter, you hopefully have something else to tribute, or Ubel's going to kill herself, and you're not going to get terror, so, yeah. Uh, this card at least fill by your opponent's card, either by battle or by card effect, you can collect 2,000 damage to your opponent, you can only activate this effect once per turn. Yeah, okay. I guess. I mean, that's, that's, that's fine. A little bit of burn, never hurt anybody. Just 2,000. I mean, that could be the difference between winning and losing, uh, especially when, you know, you have, like, you know, you bell being a 3,000 beater. You have Ultimate Nightmare attacking you and inflicting damage to you. So, you know, uh, you can easily just bust this out and be like, yeah, go ahead, get rid of him. Get rid of him. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> and it just leaves the field by your opponent's card effect. So even if they cast Dale and Beck to the extra deck, he'll still go off and burn you. So you pretty much got to 101 him. Uh, but, um, you click it 2000? I can see that. Uh, the creator of this card, you know, you see right there, it says too strong. Not really. This card's not that great. It's really difficult to make. Like, it's really specific in, in, in its materials. It pretty much only works for one particular monster. Really. I mean, I get it's a Ubel card, but it's just like a few time monster with zero attack and defense. Like, yeah, there's not too many of those. So, yeah, you summon it, and if you're summoning Ubel, this card can't be tributed, so you summon this, you summon Ubel, Ubel's a 3,000 beater, I get you attack and attack, and then Ubel kills herself, and then you have this guy remaining on the field who's not really doing much anymore, you know? It's not like it's once per turn you can keep summoning, it's just when this card is synchro summoning. So you only get the effect one, Ubel's gonna tribute, uh, get rid of herself, destroy herself, and no effect, you have this guy, your opponent, even if you got two direct attacks in with this and Ubel, that's only 5,000, which means that if they kill this guy, he'll inflict like 2,000, they still got 1,000 left. So it's not even like exactly game. So, eh, eh, I don't know. I don't know. So I don't think this card is too strong. I don't think it's OP. I'm just not a big fan of it, you know? And, and final verdict, I would rather, if I'm going to sink eight into something, I'd much rather sink eight into other cards. I'd rather sink eight with, into Beals. I'd rather sink eight into Scrap Dragon, Star, you know, Hot Red, Scar Right. Like, the more standalone cards. Like, this card is only as good as the Bell in your graveyard, and still the play is kind of meh. So, there you go. There you go. <laughs> so, tell me what you guys think about the Dabalic Archfiend in the comment section below. So, I hope that you guys enjoyed the Shark Card Friday. Thank you for sending this card to me. I really do appreciate it that uh, in this series of Fake Card Friday, we can just go ahead you guys can go on yugiocardmaker.net, make the card, and send it over to me, you know? And if I see, like, you know what? Yeah, sure, we'll go ahead and do the Fake Card Friday in that. It'll be featured, you know? 
They actually have some people who like do the fake card and then don't even realize that bam, all of a sudden their cards in fake card Friday and they're like super shocked. So yeah. Uh, anyway, I hope that you guys enjoyed. I'll be back next Friday with another fake card to look at. And yeah, thanks for watching.